To export transparent elements from Final Cut Pro, you don't need to delete anything or promote things to the primary storyline. Just use the V key or right click and select Disable to turn off any elements that don't belong in the final export. Use the Range Selection tool to select the section that you want to export. This range can be on any clip and it'll capture everything within that time range. Go to the Share button and select Master File. Click on the Settings tab and in the menu next to Video Codec, select Apple ProRes 4444. The extra 4 is for your alpha channel. Click Next and save your file. Don't forget to change the settings back before your next export. When you drag that resulting clip into your other project, all the transparent stuff will be transparent. That's it. That's how you get transparent stuff out of Final Cut Pro in like 45 seconds. It's super easy, but if you want to know a little bit more, here you go. Keeping transparent elements saves you from rebuilding stuff inside Final Cut Pro or opening up old projects to copy stuff out of those. If you develop a nice little like and subscribe graphic or an animated channel bug or a lower third, you can have all of those things in one folder for later use. Exporting a ProRes 4444 does not respect layers that are using a blend mode like Add or Multiply. If you export anything with elements that don't have actual transparent alpha channels, whatever you're hiding with the blend mode is going to come back. Back in black, even. Try turning off some layers. You didn't reset your master file export settings to ProRes 422 like I said. Good job.